San Francisco quietly launched its latest free shuttle service. KTV's Christian Captain joins us live from Treasure Island where the loop is up and running. And Christian, this service uses autonomous vehicles. Yeah, we're actually standing at one of the Loop's uh, shuttle stops right now. The Loop is a small shuttle that offers free service for people around the island here right here on Treasure Island. Treasure Island's newest transit option is now up and running. The Loop is a free shuttle and one of the state's first to use autonomous vehicles on public roadways. The shuttles operate seven days a week from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m., making a 20-minute loop around the northern side of Treasure Island. The shuttles are provided by Beep, an autonomous vehicle company out of Florida. Although autonomous, there is an operator on board to assist passengers and take over if the vehicle encounters any difficulties. Treasure Island Wines is on the Loop's route, and owner Jim Morawski says some of the first reviews from riders are now in. I've heard from a few of the uh, the residents is that it's kind of jerky and it doesn't it goes too slow and um, it it it's kind of it's not very comfortable. San Francisco's Treasure Island Mobility Management Agency launched the pilot program Wednesday with funding from San Francisco, the Metropolitan Transportation Commission, and the federal government. Morawski says so far he's not impressed. He says the vehicles are underpowered, so they can't make it up the hill to serve the Yerba Buena side of the island. And he says they operate so slowly they can't take people to and from the new ferry terminal because they'd cause a traffic hazard. He says the idea was sold to businesses as a way to bring customers. But if the shuttle can't go all the way to the ferry, it can't get the customers to his winery. It's not going to where it's supposed to go. <laughs> so hopefully they'll, they'll come up with a, with a solution. And they're working on finding all those solutions. This is part of a nine-month trial, so the Treasure Island Mobility Management Agency is looking for feedback to see if this is a good fit. They're asking riders what they think about the service and what can be improved. Uh, the transit agency says it'll take that information going forward to figure out future permanent transpo uh, transportation options and what that will look like here on Treasure Island. We're live in San Francisco. Christian Kaftan, KTVU, Fox 2 News.